and we should be hopefully everything's working and you can hear me fine uh yes you should be able to hear me fine hello everybody oh and now i'm hearing a uh, mic playback from myself in the live stream all right sweet we are live with Chaos Modeling Challenge number eight. Hello to everybody that already came out and is already joining in chat before the stream even started. That's always super exciting to see. We've already got 32 of you, it says, as I'm speaking here. Uh, so, yeah, that's pretty awesome. So anyway, welcome to the Chaos Modeling Challenge. For those of you who have never been here before, basically this challenge is, well, we use this crazy subject generator. Let me show you my screen here. We use this crazy subject generator down here that generates some wacky topics and then we try and 3D model them in an extremely short period of time and then we share them all in Discord. So if you aren't already part of our Discord server, make sure you go ahead and click. There's a link right in the top of the description. At least there should be if I set this up right. I actually never checked that. Um, hopefully there's a link down there. I can't find the, the way to change it. Yeah, I can't, I can't see it in the live stream page right now. Um, but hopefully there is a link down there uh, to join the Discord server. If not, you can just go to remington.pro slash Discord and it'll uh, redirect you. We'll be doing everything in the stream chat channel. So everything that is going on is going to happen in here. Uh, and somebody just asked, is Photoshop allowed? Technically anything's allowed. You can use whatever medium you'd like. Uh, we have people using MS Paint uh, all the time. We have people using just straight up drawing on paper a few times. So really anything you want to use. And of course, the uh, audience is welcome to join in with everything as well. So I'm going to go ahead and unmute the uh, the rest of the people that are currently in the stream chat. Oh, it looks like Zohab just joined us. Uh, so we can go ahead and start the first round here. So let me unmute my desktop audio and let me jump into stream private here. Hello, everybody. Yo. Yo. Hi. Yo. We're all officially on stream here. All right. Awesome. So, um, I'm just realizing my camera is very yellow right now. I didn't set my white balance correctly. Oh, well, I guess I'm just going to be like glowing golden for the rest of the stream here. Hopefully you guys don't mind. Um, looks like everything is going well in chat. So perfect. You guys want to just go ahead and jump right in here and start the first round or you guys need a second to get ready? Uh, I'm ready for the first I'm round. Ready. You ready? Grant, I know you're still in the kitchen, because that's why he's got his mic muted. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, it's okay. We can't hear you right now. Um, all right. Sweet. All right, so let's go ahead and just go through some topics here, and um, if any of you hear one, well, I guess we'll, we'll just do a few. And we'll try and find one that seems interesting to us. And if we uh, find one that we think is particularly good, we'll go ahead and attempt to create it to the best of our abilities. Uh, so you guys ready for the first topic? Yeah. Yeah? All right. Sweet. All right. Our first topic is going to be Barbarian Shovel. I'm not sure how I feel about that one. Hmm. You could do like a shovel with like a Viking hat or something. You could. Feeling kind of uninspired with that. Oh, also. Yeah. Um. Actually, here, here's another idea. Um. For those of you in chat, I forgot I implemented this feature. We can set a random seed for the generator. So if you guys want to come up with a seed, just any sort of word, and it will convert it into a random seed. I'd like to see what you guys can come up with here. <laughs> Burger is the first one that we get. Anybody in a... Okay, it seems like a lot of people are liking burger. Bean. French. I'm seeing. No. Bean burger. <laughs> maybe, yeah, maybe we'll just use bean burger as the seed. Bean burger. Question mark. That's the most important part is the question mark. Oh wait, oh man, we're getting so many, <laughs> so many different combinations. Okay, hang on. I think we're gonna go with this combobulated bean burger question mark. 
Oh wait, discombobulated. All right. So discombobulated bean burger is going to be our subject here. Our, our uh, God, not our subject. Our uh, seed to re randomly generate more of these topics. Because I'm not a big fan of barbarian shovel. So let's try a new one. Grape corn dog. I don't like grape corn dog either. Hmm. All right. Uh, let's do one more. No, that one's really weird. A hand licking a doorknob. I don't like that at all. Um. Hmm. A broccoli mouth breather. I actually kind of like that one. Did you guys be down to model a broccoli mouth breather? Or not. <laughs> Zohib says yes. Nobody else responded. <laughs> All right, everybody Everybody in stream chat is saying yeah, so I guess we'll rely on stream chat here. Um, so let's go ahead and try and model a broccoli mouth breather. We have the option to do, uh, we can either do a 10 minute round or I was also thinking it might be a good idea to do 12 minutes and 30 seconds to give us some extra time to really pull something nice together. Any of you have any opinion over whether we should do 10 minutes or 12 and a half minutes? How about 30 minutes and 37 seconds, so it's lead time. <laughs> That's uh, not a bad idea. 13 minutes and 37 seconds. Oh, wait. 37. There we go. Do we, <laughs> we want to do that? That'd actually be kind of funny. Put it together, leet. Uh, Alright, it seems like people are saying leet. So, either people are saying 12 and a half or leet. So, I think we're going to go with leet time for this one. We'll do 13 minutes and 37 seconds. We're gonna try and model this uh, this here broccoli mouth breather, whatever that means, to the best of our ability, um, and hopefully we can get this started. So if you don't already have Blender open or whatever software you're using to create things, go ahead and open that up now. Otherwise, you're gonna be uh, a little bit behind. I'll give you guys a few minutes to, not a few minutes, but a few seconds to do that, and then uh, we'll get going here. I just realized I don't have any background music right now. I forgot about that. Probably should have added some. All right. So if you don't already have your broccoli mouth breather up and modeled, or not your broccoli, <laughs> gosh. If you don't already have Blender open or whatever software you're using, you might want to do that. We're going to go ahead and start here in about five seconds. So five, four, three, two, one and go all right i'm gonna be honest here wait why isn't my middle mouse button working why isn't oh my gosh okay that was weird for like the first 10 seconds there might what is going on oh, i'm so sad i stopped started the clock already why is this not working okay there we go i don't know why my middle mouse button wasn't working for a little bit there but now it is do you guys have any inspiration for your, for those of you in the stream chat, do you have any inspiration for your broccoli mouth breather? I don't know, really know where I'm going to go with it. I have no idea. You have no idea? Neither. Let's see here. Let's try and figure something out. Hmm. I'm thinking I'm going to try and create a character with this, but I don't know how I'm going to do it. Oh, can I use metaballs? Hmm. I've been matching for 21 minutes. That's really unfortunate, Jack. Can you, how do you change the metaballs resolution? I don't remember how to do that. This is unfortunate. Oop, I got an email from Patreon. Thanks, Patreon. All right, we're just going to use Icospheres. You know, this is going to be like a really rough round for me, or this entire time is going to be a really rough round because uh, I haven't actually worked on a Blender project for like ever. I think the last time I worked on a Blender project was August. 
so we're a little yeah, bit same. behind. That's why I'm solving. <laughs> I'm just like chugging along slowly here, trying to survive. Um, let's see here. <laughs> Somebody in a uh, the the chat said uh that we should try and model our mouth breather broccoli in uh just ten minutes. It's a little bit ambitious for me. We're gonna go with Eevee for this one. Ooh, I already have an HDRI loaded up apparently. Cool. Okay. Um Why am I feel, feeling oddly inspired to actually work on this broccoli mouth breather thing? Kind of weirded out by that. I kind of like this topic. What in the world is happening? I keep clicking the center mouse button to rotate, but it's not letting me. That's so sad. Like every third attempt it works. And I'm a little bit upset about that. try and give this guy a little backdrop on mine. I think this might be the best piece of low poly broccoli I've ever 3D modeled. I'm actually kind of proud of this right now, guys. How do I change the output resolution? That's how long it's been since I've used Blender. I can't remember how to change the output resolution. There we go. So I'm going to try and create a mouth from this right here. Let's see. Oh, hey, Blender Box in uh, stream chat. Hello, Bach. Um, let's see here. You know, I just realized that I have this like style for characters that I always go to whenever I have to like model them in a really short period of time. <laughs> it's just the same style over and over, but it works really well for like really quick modeling. We got about seven minutes left, by the way, just so you guys know.
Okay. You know, having this extra time is actually pretty useful, I'd say. <laughs> I'm enjoying this a lot more than I usually do, which may or may not be a good thing. Because one of the fun parts about this is just having to just try and deal with the anarchy of creating a 3D model in such a short period of time. Gosh, I keep messing up my hotkeys. Like, I, I totally did not mean to delete that, but I just did. That's so unfortunate. Hmm. That doesn't seem to fit the right attitude I want. How does the mirror modifier work? I forgot. This is not good. There we go. Alright, we got 3 minutes and 41 seconds left. to make the uh, the rest of this really kind of goofy. I don't know how I'm going to do any more of this in the time I have. Oh no. Uh oh. I didn't think about this. Okay, hang on. Wait. Can't see with all the Ico spheres in the way. Okay. <laughs> okay, cool. Two minutes and 21 seconds remaining. <sighs> Somebody said give, give my character a mustache. I don't know if I'll have time to, but if I have time to, I will. I gotta finish the eyes first. I kind of think I left the uh, the mouth breather topic a little bit here. I kind of just ended up going with a nerdy piece of broccoli, but it's all right. <laughs> 
We got one minute and 18 seconds remaining. This might be one of my, uh... So he says leave one eye bigger than the other. Maybe that would work. Oh, I kind of like that. Hang on, except with this eye. It kind of adds some character to it, I think. Good suggestion. Good critique. Spheres back. I don't like that. That was supposed to be like a drip of drool, but it kind of just looks gross. So now we just kind of have a, a scared piece of broccoli. <laughs> oh, we got 25 seconds remaining. Alright, let's set this up a little bit. Look up the field. Um, oh no, we got 12 seconds. Okay. Field is gonna focus on empty. Ooh. All right, that's it. Time is up. Ooh. That was intense. Okay, so with our elite amount of time up, it's time to render and uh, we'll send all of our creations uh, in. What's it called? I'm set to seven five. Uh, we'll send all of our creations in stream chat, and uh, we'll see what everybody came up with. Actually, you know what, I'm gonna render this in cycles just cause I think it'll look better in cycles. Oh yeah, it looks a thousand times better in cycles. Um, let's see here. My stream might lag a little bit as I render here. So don't be surprised if it jumps around a little bit, but it shouldn't be too bad. Where's my render settings? Performance, oops. Let's up the tile size here. Oh man, I'm already seeing some pretty good uh some pretty good ones coming in in the in the stream chat. <laughs> I'm excited. Okay, we'll save mine, save as to my desktop and we'll call this broccoli mouth breather even though that's mine still kind of wait. <laughs> I just created a directory on my C drive called broccoli mouth breather. I'm smart. I'm still not used to the whole um, user interface change that 2.81 brought for the save dialog. All right, there's my broccoli mouth breather. Breather, we'll save this here too. Um, mouth breather. Okay, cool. And we'll go ahead and send our beautiful creations. All right, and I'm gonna start scrolling through some of these starting at the top here. So where did we start? All right. Um, so as more and more of these come in, we'll keep reading more and more, but this is our first round participation. This is what people thought in, thought of at the, the, the first round. So uh, let's see how some of these came out. We start off with the gravity boy and his beautiful horse with broccoli coming out of his nose. I think this is, this must've, I think, yeah. So, for those of you who aren't familiar, Tom, he's in the voice chat right now, but I think actually he's been the only Hello. one that's really talking. Yeah, Tom is, uh, drew this little horsey. Um, do I have a picture of horsey? And I gotta see if it's in my memes folder. <laughs> I have a memes folder just for... The emoji. I could show them the emoji, that's a good point. Um, let's see, really quick though, I could have sworn I had one. No? I guess not. Well, that's sad. Either way, um, we'll move this out of the way for a second. Here, uh, we have this little horsey, and uh, he's kind of become an idol of the channel. So, uh, and a few other channels, I think, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, I think that's what the uh, Gravity Boy was trying to recreate here. So, very nice. Great work, Gravity. Um, let's see. What else do we got going on? We got Boombox renamed himself to everyone and boombox i just want to let you know that i almost pinged you earlier when i was trying to ping the rest of the world i typed in at everyone all you did was pop up 
so you almost got me there um but there's his broccoli mouth breather which kind of just looks like broccoli with a a hole but very nice anyway um we got yg and <laughs> this very nice um oh we got viv participating here she says the uh my broccoli looks kind of like clovers oops oh and she actually drew this so uh i mean i guess that works mouth breather and if you do that in 13 minutes i'm kind of impressed because i could not have done that although the hand got a little bit creepy but that's understandable we got opus geo with a video let's see if we can download it here ah we got an animation <laughs> very nice i like how he goes cross-eyed in the middle of it that's pretty funny um let's see here okay um we got skylifter he sure is breathing <laughs> yeah i'd say so would you say so skylifter unless he oh, yeah, himself. Definitely. oh yeah definitely oh yeah definitely I like the waves that you added in. It's a nice touch. And your meta ball broccoli things. Um, is this a broccoli inhaler? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Jacob, what did you create? <laughs> okay, Heike, like, like, imagine. I want you guys in stream chat right now to just imagine taking an inhaler and trying to take a puff but just having a bunch of like broccoli sprayed down your throat instead <laughs> what does that sound like i just imagine like oozing grossness just like <laughs> oh boy Gross. but i'm imagining like i'm imagining like the little tiny buds like on the top of the broccoli just getting launched into your throat i hate that delete that i don't want it anymore <laughs> Um, we got David Chi with his mouth breather broccoli. That's actually pretty good. That characterizes the mouth breather aspect well, where it's just a mouth and he's, I don't even know what he's drinking, but I like that you characterize that well, given the amount of time you had. And then we have 16 by 9 with this horrifying work of art. Oh my god. This looks like when, um, what is it? When you have like those animations from like, uh, or the, the animation bloopers from Pixar bloopers where like, you'll have like a character's head and they move it backwards, but their eyes don't move and their teeth don't move. So they just kind of like float out of their head. That's what this looks like. That's a work of art. Oh, we have Grant number two with an, <laughs> is that a Tumblr logo around its neck? Yes. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I like that Grant joins in just to say yes. Oh man. Yeah. Cool. Very nice way to call out everybody on Tumblr. Um, we got, what appears to be a, somebody mouth breathing broccoli. That kind of throws me back to the, um, to the, uh, what is it? Throws me back to the broccoli inhaler. Wonderful. Oh, we have Tom with. Uh, it's broccoli on a microscopic tongue. Well, wow. so those are the little, uh, bits that stick off your tongue that the broccoli's on. Well, there you go. I didn't consider that, but very nice. Huh. I like the colors you use. Like, right. actually, yeah. I actually really like the colors there. That blue is a really nice blue. I, I didn't expect to like that um, as much as I did. But then we have mine, which I kind of ditched the mouth breather aspect and kind of just went for something else. But there you go. It almost looks like something from, uh, oh, God, what's that movie? I can't remember what it's called. Anyway, um, moving on, we got mouse batteries. Who seem to take like a pretty similar approach to me. I kind of looks like Pop Tropica. Pop Tropica? Pop Tropica. What is Pop Tropica? Oh, I see Pop Tropica. Yeah, it does look like Pop Tro Tropica. <laughs> I like the like Mickey Mouse style gloves on them too. It's a nice touch. We have Gabe with this atrocity. What is that? <laughs> I, I honestly don't know. I think that's probably my favorite. Yeah, that's a really good one. Mind. It's, it looks like it's wildly disturbed. Just like screaming, but its soul <laughs> can't escape. <laughs> How would you feel if you found out you broccoli? I'd probably react the same way he Yeah. Yeah, I'd have to agree. I would... I. Is that what this is, Gabe? It's a, it's a rendition of the emotion experienced when you find out you're a piece of broccoli? Sure. 
Yeah, let's go with that. That's really deep. It's beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> to work of art. All right. Um, moving on, we have Mr. Jeez, we got a lot of them this time. We still got a ways to go. You got Mr. Ladybug and his broccoli with a gas mask on. Very nice. We got Skuma and his <laughs> piece of broccoli with a face like pressed into it. That's kind of horrifying. I imagine this like being on like a tree in the middle of the woods and you just see like a creepy smiley face pressed into the tree. We got Opus Geo with, I think, oh, he sent this one earlier, but the animated version. And we got a bunch of horsies. Maybe that's what the rest of the chat is, just horsies. Um, but we got Randrake. I'm confused. <laughs> I'm guessing this is supposed to be like an oxygen tank. But I'm a little bit offset by Suzanne poking her head out of the middle of the broccoli. That's kind of off-putting, but very nice. Um, <laughs> we got Zohaib and what he titles is a disaster himself. And Zohaib, I'm, I'm going to have to agree with you that it is kind of disastrous. Although, I do like the shape of it for some reason. I find it very appealing. Oh, <laughs> and then Jacob sent a, uh, another broccoli inhaler render. Very nice. Inhale your broccoli. I'll buy it for twenty one sixty nine. <laughs> oh my goodness. Very nice. Uh, Boombox, if you want to re-upload, you can. We're going to move on to the next topic, I think. But for future reference, if you want to make some small tweaks and then re-upload, you're more than welcome to. It's not like there's any specific rules. We just kind of go through and enjoy things as we go. All right. So there, there we have it. We have the broccoli mouth breather. That was a pretty fun one. Why is this getting more and more red? And... On stream, do I look like really orange as well? I feel like I do. I wonder if I can change. Hang on, let me try and change the settings on my camera to adjust the white balance. I might get noisy for a second here. Where's my white balance? Where's my white balance? We'll set this to auto white balance. How about that? <coughs> that looks better. Now I'm not flaming an orange. <laughs> Perfect. All right. Um, with that, I think we're ready to move on to our next subject. Ooh. After I get a drink of water, of course. All right. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and reset my Blender file back to the default. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and reset the timer here. And we're going to go ahead and generate some new subjects. Who's that, who's that cameo in the back? That is my, that's my roommate. Wait, I'm trying to point to him. That's my roommate, Jack. Jack's currently playing Escape from Tarkov, and... Uh, I was waiting in a match for 45 minutes, so I stopped. He was waiting in a match for 45 minutes, but then he stopped, in case you couldn't hear that. I really want to play Escape from Tarkov. Do any of you guys play Escape from Tarkov in chat? Or in voice chat? I've heard it's good. I've never played it, though. Yeah. I've heard, like, it looks really fun, but it's like, I'm really bad at first-person shooters, so... It got loads of attention recently, because of uh, some updates. Gotcha. Huh. Wow. I'll have to play it sometime. Alright. Uh, next subject. Those of you in voice chat, you guys ready? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Alright. Let's give this another, another round, and we'll decide whether we want to do some of these, or if we want to try a different one. Alright. So we'll start with, a, we got grape corn dog again. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever gotten a repeat. Unless did I, me resetting the seed break it? Oh, it did. Interesting. Discombobulated bean burger. Did I not implement the random seed correctly? Grape corn dog. Hand licking a doorknob. <laughs> well, interesting. Uh, I guess I guess we really want to do a grape corn dog, but I really don't want to do a grape corn dog. <laughs> so we'll keep uh, keep clicking these. We got broccoli mouth breather again. Flashy sports car. Wow, that's a that's an uninteresting one. I just realized my microphone's like super far away from my face. I bet you wouldn't. That's a really chaotic one. Um, not really. Lake crawling under a wheel. Nah. Um, <laughs> yeah. Okay, I like this one. We'll see what you guys think. Army cow. An army cow. Yes. Yes? Army I think cow. so. 
like an army cow, a cow in the army. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Definitely. All right. One hundred percent. <laughs> let's go ahead and yeah it seems like people in chat are saying let's do army cow as well so let's go ahead and do we'll go ahead and create an army cow uh we'll throw the same amount of time on the clock we'll go leap time again it actually seems to be a pretty good amount of time to make something cool challenge is i don't know how to 3d model a cow so we're gonna have to see how this goes here this is gonna be uh pretty atrocious for me maybe i can stylize it enough all right, anyway, 13 minutes and 37 seconds on the clock. Are you guys ready? Yep. All right. Mm -hmm. We're going to start in three, two, one, go. All right. Do any of you know how to model a cow? Because I really don't. <laughs> uh, just, I don't. Like how you model a horse, but oh, <laughs> thank you. Okay. Why isn't my middle mouse button working? Is there some sort of setting I have here? Do I have, like... Input. Uh, I'm gonna cry. Editing animation input. Oh, there it is. What in the world? Okay, whatever. We'll just accept my fate, and I'll just try and deal with it throughout. Okay. Um. Gosh, this is so, oh no, my head is completely off center for my cow. <laughs> That's no good. All right, we'll recenter that, kind of. Okay. That cow's head is way too big. Cows have nice wide shoulders, so we'll give them some wide shoulders. <laughs> oh goodness. I don't like this one. I like this one, but I don't like it. And I don't know how I'm gonna make it an army cow. I could give it like a helmet, but I feel like that's unoriginal. I don't know. Hmm. Somebody says sculpt maybe. See, I would sculpt, but I'm really bad at sculpting. So uh, we're not gonna try and mess with that at all. Okay, so there's gonna be the main part of our cow and then I'm gonna get like some legs on this boy. It's not a horrible back leg. It's not good by any means, but it's all right. I don't know how to do a front leg though. I feel like the front leg's gonna be even harder. Make a stains like, oh yeah, that's a good idea. Make the like spots on the cow like army camouflage. Hmm. Let's see here. Should just use the back leg as the front now. Yes. Maybe we'll just modify the proportions. Make it a little skinnier.
All right. Oh shoot, we're already at nine minutes. I don't know how I'm gonna be able to finish this one. This one's gonna be really rough. Really, really rough. We're gonna give it a shot anyway. That did not work, apparently. Why isn't this just working? I'm so confused. Oh, because I have to rotate it. I'm a dum dum. <laughs> oh gosh, what is this? No. This is so ugly. Um, ooh, I just realized how I'm gonna turn this into an army cow. I have a brilliant idea. Okay, um, really quick, let's move this into a new collection here. And hide our cow. Should probably be doing this in look dev mode, a material preview mode so I can Make this just a regular brown cow. Okay. So we'll hide our cow. Wait, why is the cylinder back in the cow collection? I don't want this. I'm out. Okay. Hide our cow. There is a way to do radial arrays in Blender, but I cannot remember how, so we're just gonna do it like this. Oh, you have to we... make a curve in the curve multiplier. Do you? I thought you could do yeah, like yeah. a- Use a rotated empty. Oh yeah, that's all right. I was gonna say, I thought you could do it with an empty, but I don't remember how to do it at all, so we're just gonna let it be. Um... Why isn't my middle mouse button working? I'm wondering if my mouse is broken. I haven't needed it for anything else recently because I haven't opened Blender in like six months, but. Have you guys had, uh, those of you in chat, or in voice chat, have you guys had any, uh, brilliant ideas for this yet? Or are you guys just kind of chugging along? You can probably take a guess at what I'm doing. <laughs> a tank? Definitely. Figured. That would make sense for you. <laughs> it depends if I can find the horsey uh, picture on my laptop. Alright, um... No, middle mouse button, work. I got five minutes left and my middle mouse button still won't work. There we go.
This one's going to be a close one for me. We're at 3 minutes and 45 seconds remaining. Normals, auto smooth. There we go. Apparently I have a duplicate leg here. I don't know how that got there. Alright. Um, let's make some materials here. Somebody just asked me how long is this stream going to last? Usually we do like four or five of these topics, although we're kind of blazing through them right now because we aren't taking a lot of time in between. So I don't know. It could go anywhere between like an hour to two hours, but it varies every single time we do them. So I'd expect somewhere between like 20 and 30 more minutes, I'd say. Ooh. Oh, we got two minutes left already. Oh, snap. Aw, oh, beans. If Arnold's was here, that would, that would be what he say. Aw, oh, beans. Seems to be a common theme for him. Aw, oh, beans? Aw, oh, beans. Dude likes beans, what can I say? Um, wait, can you hear my mic? Oh, wait, that's Zohaib. Yeah, I can hear you. <laughs> I didn't realize it was you for a second there. I thought it was somebody else. Welcome to uh to the chat, Zohabe. Yeah. Um. Let's see here. Uh, why can't auto auto uh what is it what is it auto smooth normals be on by default? That'd be a very useful feature. My cow is gonna be jacked up. <laughs> is it? <laughs> Army of cows. You made an army? Oh, I guess no, I yeah. Did the same thing. Oh shoot! Why did I just? Oh, okay. Um, create new material. Assign. Wait, no, I didn't want that. Go back. Oh, we got forty-two seconds left. Oh no. Oh. Can you make an image empty show up in the render? I don't know. Uh, I'm doing it. Oh gosh, that looks bad. Oh, we might just have to screenshot it. Yeah. Um, I don't even have a camera set up. Oh gosh. No, 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 no. I got 12 seconds left. No, I hit the wrong hotkey combo. No. Okay, I'm going to have to set the camera up after time runs up, but hopefully that won't be such a... Okay. Time is up. All right. Everybody go ahead and hit render, and uh, let's share these abominations with each other. Let me just change the HDRI here. Something different. There we go. Okay. Oh, why is one of my cow's legs white? That's okay. He's going to have a bionic leg. That's the story I'm going with. Oh, wait, no. There's an overlapping leg there, too. Never mind. What? I'm so confused. Okay. He's going to have a bionic leg. Bionic leg cow. Um... And we'll render this. Where's denoising at? I gotta turn on some denoising because I'm rendering this at low samples. All right, I'm excited to see your bionic cows, or not your bionic cows, your army cows. I'm already seeing a, f a few good ones pop up in chat. <laughs> I'm excited to see where these go. Here, while these roll in, we'll pop this over here. 
Let's go render so you guys can see these beautiful works of art. Oh, I see some people sending progress. Boombox sent a, a render a few minutes in or a screenshot from a few minutes in. Okay, uh, image, save as. What is this one going to be called? This one's going to be called Army Cow. All right. And then we'll save my project as well as Army Cow. Okay. Um, <laughs> these are abominable. Let me send mine. Where is it? Desktop Army Cow. There's mine. I think it's funny. I kind of I kind of developed a style for these chaos modeling challenges because I've done so many of them. I like have a have a method that works for me, and I just do that every single time. I think it's kind of funny. Oh man, it's dark outside now. When I started this stream, it was all light outside. It's still light outside for me. It's only like four o'clock. Is it? Are you in West Coast person? Yeah. Yeah, I'm in the middle of the United States, so it's dark here already. Oh goodness, these are coming in, and they are <laughs> evil. <laughs> all right, we're gonna start from the top with, well. <laughs> Blender box sent something that exists. I, I don't know how to describe it. He's, he described it as a dog, I guess. So that was made in 30 seconds. Uh, but let's see. Let's keep going. We got Gravity Boy with his cow standing on a tank with a bunch of grenades in its belt with a gun strapped to it and a missile on its back. Some sort of X. I'm not sure what that is. Um, and an army head. Oh, you know, that might be it. It might be a propeller. That cow looks dangerous. That cow is out to kill. Um, what is it? We got Boombox and his cow that has... Is its Art's arms flexing right now? Do you guys see Boombox's thing? Is that what it's doing? Or am yeah. I just completely... Is a cow flexing with legs? That's horrifying. Very nice, though. Very nice. Um, we got Opus Geo in this... What appears to be a bust of a... Uh, cow an army cow but why has it got a disney mgm studios badge on it i'm very confused i don't understand is that a reference that i don't understand or are you guys just as confused as i am i think you're just as confused all right um what is it we got viv's beautiful u.s army cow very nice very well drawn good work um, David Shee and his cow, which looks like it's got a, it's got a sword on its back. Reminds me of that one meme where it's like, while you studied in school, or while you played around in school, I studied the blade or whatever. <laughs> Except this is the kid that says it to you. The one with the, the cow with the sword and epaulets on, or shoulder pads, one of the two. Um, oh, ZLSA made a straight up cow tank. Very nice. Very nice. It's looking snazzy. Um, we got Jordan. Jordan says he hasn't used Blender almost here, but at least the new sculpting is nice. That's how I feel, man. That's how I feel. I haven't done anything with Blender in so long. It's a it's a tough it's a tough route. I like your profile picture though. Um, we got my cow with a robotic leg that has a giant mini gun attached to its back, giant turret. Um, Jules kind of did something similar, except with a laser attached to the head. That would be kind of horrifying if you saw that walk around a quarter. Skuma looks like he's got a Minecraft cow. <laughs> <laughs> that looks depressing. That cow looks super depressed. I, f I mean, I got you did Mine. caption. Wait, what? Mine looks like a dog. <laughs> oh, does it? <laughs> I guess, uh, what is it? Skuma did title his, he's in the aftermath of war, so that makes sense. Okay, we got Jacobs with a cyber cow. Looks like it's modeled after the cyber truck or something. Very nice. Although I'm not really sure. Um, oh wait, available at your lo local Chevy dealer only, $70,000. We got Tom again with a beautiful drawing of horsey on a cow <laughs> with a spear. Very nice, very nice. I approve. Cows are too dumb to uh, fight in wars, so horsey has to ride them. Tell them Have what to do. Have you considered, like, taking one of these and just setting it as your wallpaper? Uh, no, I've got my little poly stuff as uh, my wallpaper. I think I think something like this should be your wallpaper. 
Although, although this would be actually really fun as like a laptop wallpaper, so you can like open it up somewhere, like outside of your house, and people are just like, yeah. "Why? <laughs> what? <laughs> what is going on here?" Uh, anyway, let's move on. Um, we got Roan with his. Oh gosh. Oh, it looks like he did a similar thing. He strapped a bunch of miniguns to their backs, but then he had like 4,000 of them. That's mildly horrifying. You versus a bunch of cows with miniguns strapped to their backs. Who would win? Uh, we got Gabe. And oh, there's like an... Oh, those are actually kind of cute cows. Did you make those in the time period? Well, I made one, and then I just used the particle system. Gotcha. Those are actually really cute. I like how those are styled. <laughs> Thanks. But then, then you got the planes flying overhead. Very nice. Excellent work. Uh, what else we got here? We got Randrake with his army of army cows. Very nice. Oh, guess that tank, Grant. Yep. We got a tank from uh, Grant number two. With it. Well, actually, it's not a tank. It's a bunch of cows in a tank. Why are there burgers? Oh! It's running them over and turning them into burgers. Is that what's happening here, Grant? Yeah, that's what's happening. No! Not the army cows. <laughs> Yo, what's... Okay, for real, though, that, like, cow in the tank is screwed up. He's, like... Like, imagine the human equivalent of that. Somebody that just runs somebody over in, like, a combine and then harvests their meat and makes human ground beef out of it. <laughs> But not just any burgers, Discom discombobulated bean burgers. <laughs> discombobulated bean burgers. <laughs> oh, that I is evil. About, I forgot about the bean burgers. <laughs> Alright, um, what else we got here? We got Skylifter is definitely cow. Well, what else would it be? What, do you want me to think it's like a horse or something? Clearly not. Um, what else? 16 by 9 blender, blender crashed so many times during this I had to turn off the grass It's all right. I think we get the main concept instead of being on the, like a grassy field. He's on the moon now He's part of the space force. He's a space force cow not an army cow Very nice. He's got like a I don't know if that's a jetpack on him or if that's supposed to be my minigun attempt or something similar to my minigun attempts um, <laughs> oh. Why gee I don't know what this is but it exists. So we got two cows with camo spots. One of them has a sword. Both of them have Captain America helmets. And it appears as though there's a tire. And a semi-automatic assault hammer. <laughs> Facing backwards, may I add. Oh, man. Wait, what, what about the wheels? It looks like it's from Happy Wheels. With the, uh, oh, the Happy five. Wheels. <laughs> it does. That does look like it's from Happy Wheels. Um, Grant number four, my blender crashed, so here's this abomination. Very nice. What's a Happy Wheels? Ha Happy Wheels? Have you? It's a. It's what is it? It's a game where like you race. Yeah, it down recently. Yeah, I. It's, uh, I don't know how to describe it other than like an extremely gory racing game, but cartoon gore. We'll just have to do another stream after this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Happy Wheels stream or something. Um, shut down the website now, so you can't play it no more. Did they? No. Yeah. That's so sad. Uh, that's sadder than when Club Penguin got shut down. Just kidding. When Club Penguin got was, shut down, that hit me hard. Uh, was Bar was Barndles in the voice chat earlier? He he was earlier, but he had to leave before the stream started because he's working on his uh his game jam thing. Oh. So. Oh. Yeah. It's my dog. <laughs> Alright, uh, oh yeah, I see it. <laughs> I, actually, the, yeah, I don't even know what to think about that. That's horrifying. <laughs> that looks like what would happen if you took like a, a, a dog, a frog, and like a cicada, mushed them together, and then like turned it to liquid. And then just sprayed it with cow splatter. I don't even know. Uh, oh, we missed Johnson. Johnson has a bunch of, oh, they're in like salute form with the gun on their shoulder. Very nice. Um... What is it? What else? Oh, what's up with the face cam? <laughs> okay, so what's actually happening with the face cam is right down here in the corner where my face is, I have a green screen, so if I put something green there, like this image, I'm going to appear in the background. So that's what's that's what's going on there here. We'll put myself... I'm kind of curious. What does this look like? I'm in a field of cows. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Uh, okay. Um, 
Anyone else notice that the Christmas tree is still up at Grant's? Yes. We still haven't taken down our Christmas tree. Um, it's been a long time coming. Okay. <laughs> oh, and then uh, Izux comes in with his, what he calls garbage, which I kind of agree. It looks like a depth map cow, but it is. it does look cursed, Gabe. I agree. Absolutely. It looks like... In, it looks like it needs to be deep fried. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So there we go. So we've done... What have we done so far? We've done... Broccoli Mouth Breather and Army Cow. Are we ready to do one more? I think it is deep fried. Yeah. It is. It's lightly deep fried. It's light fried. <laughs> it's like fried on a stove top. You need a pressure cooker to get any more fried. Okay, um, I'm going to save this and start up a new file. Oop, not open. New file. There we go. All right. Hmm. <laughs> Jeremiah Parker says it's, it's February in chat regarding my Christmas tree, I'm guessing. It's all right. Christmas trees, we're going to decorate it for Valentine's Day. See those those red things on it? Pretend those are hearts and it's for Valentine. It's a Valentine's Day tree, not a Christmas tree. Um, let's see here. Oh, I've been mentioned in stream chat. Grant Wilk, do you green screen yourself in your own into your own house? Don't tell anybody. This is actually a green screen behind me. Just kidding. No. Um This is actually my room, hence why you can see Jack in the background. But uh yeah, the, the window itself is green screened. Uh, anyway, what's that word generator program called? This is actually a custom application I built for this live stream, but you can download an early alpha version on it, or uh, an early alpha version of it. If you go to, it's on my GitHub page. If you go to github.com slash Grant Wilk, see here, it's like one of the main ones here. It's the chaos subject generator. If you go here and you click on releases, you can download the chaos subject generator for yourself. It's the chaos subject generator.exe. If you want to try it out, it's still not fully finished, so it's going to be buggy, but just so you guys know. All right, you guys ready for our next topic here? Yep. All right. Yeah. Let's let's do it. Is Jack procedurally generated? Jack, are you procedurally generated? Sure. He says sure. <laughs> All right. We go from army cow to <laughs> I like this worldwide Scooby Doo. <laughs> I just, you know, what is it? When I hear worldwide, I always think of like Pitbull because he's like he calls himself uh, Mr. Worldwide. Worldwide. Yeah, Mr. Worldwide, and then you get Scooby Doo, <laughs> Mr. Worldwide Scooby Doo. <laughs> oh goodness. Uh, Okay, <laughs> Jeremiah Parker says no, please. Um, like, how did you even make that? Or how do you even make that? Yeah, I don't know how I would even model worldwide Scooby Doo. Like, put uh, yeah, I would totally full space on Scooby Doo. Photoshop. Yeah, you could do that. Hmm. Or just Pitbull's face on Scooby Doo. <laughs> put Pitbull's face on Scooby. -Doo. Yo, that, that reminds me of like a few streams ago where I had some sort of adjective and everybody just started putting, um, they just started putting somebody's face on top of it for no reason. And I was so confused because I had no idea who it was. Um, okay, so I like Worldwide Scooby-Doo, but I'm not sure how to model it. So I'm going to click through yeah, two more true. of these. And if we find one that we think is better than Worldwide Scooby-Doo, we'll do that. But if we don't... Then we'll come back to Worldwide Scooby-Doo. Does that sound good to you guys? Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah. All right, cool. So we're at Worldwide Scooby-Doo. The next one is going to be Frisbee Punching a Rocket. I don't really like that one. No. And then Rancid Bottle. I think Worldwide Scooby-Doo is the move. Yeah. You guys agree? We should do that one. Yeah. yeah. All right. We'll go back to Worldwide Scooby-Doo, and uh, we'll go ahead and make Scooby extra thick or we'll put pitbull's face <laughs> on them or uh something like that or or somebody model like scooby-doo and just like wrap him around earth like he's a a ring going around it all right extra, <laughs> extra. okay um because this one's kind of weird let's uh let's crunch the time a little bit let's go back to the 10 minute time span that we did before 
Let's see if we can get this running. All right, so we're gonna have 10 minutes on the clock this time around. We're gonna try and, oh, somebody, Skuma says, I don't wanna model another animal, rancid bottle. I like the bottle. People are saying they like the bottle. Hmm. If we wanna do another animal, it has to be a horsey. <laughs> horsey, okay. Maybe maybe that should be our new rule. If we, if we have to do another animal, it should be horsey. So, with chat responding, I'm thinking maybe we should skip Worldwide Scooby-Doo and try something a little bit more hard surface and less organic. All right. Um, oh, you'll never guess what just came up on the generator. It's um, grape corn dog. <laughs> Again. <laughs> I keep, I don't know why. Oh, you know what? I know why. Every time I save the settings, it resets the random seed. So we get put way back to the beginning. Okay, um, because we're not going to be modeling worldwide Scooby Doo, we're gonna we're gonna make him the new uh, the new seed for the uh, subject generator, and we're gonna see what we get here. <laughs> Let's see. Do we want to model a sailboat fidget spinner? <laughs> Or here, here, let's do this. We'll do three at a time, and we'll decide which of the three we want to model. So we get sailboat fidget spinner, waffle smuggling a sports car, or a coffee pot with a pistachio. Coffee pot with a pistachio. Yeah, it actually coffee sounds kind of... With a pistachio. Yeah, coffee pot with a pistachio. With a singular pistachio. <laughs> with a, with a, just one. Oh. A single <laughs> pistachio. Pistachio nut. Uh... Um, I should that one. Yeah. Yeah, it seems like people like coffee pot with pistachio. <laughs> I think I think we all just kind of want a nice little break from all the chaos. All right, this will be our this will be our nice relaxed round to do something that's not organic and not going to take four hours to do. So we'll do the ten minute time or ten minutes on this one, uh, and we'll go ahead and get started here in a second. I'm going to get a drink of water though because my mouth is way too dry, and I got an email. Cool. All right, let's go ahead and um, jump in here. So we got 10 minutes on the clock, and we're going to go ahead and start in three, two, one, start. Okay. Should I go? I'm going to go high poly on this one. I don't feel like I got to go big or go home, you know? We're going to try and create a full-on render here because a coffee pot and a pistachio aren't hard things to add create That's a bad idea. I shouldn't have done that. There we go. Okay. Um. There we go. Maybe. I'm starting to think I underestimated how hard it is to model a, uh, a coffee pot. <laughs> I'm hoping I didn't. Um, let's see here. Solidify. You want to come in here and say, no, it's auto smooth. There we go. Cursor not back at the center. There we go. No, my center mouse button stopped working again. Ah, uh, this is gonna make me cry in stream or on stream. I'm just gonna start crying because my thing won't work. Oh, coffee pots have handles, don't they? Mm 
<clears throat> that's gonna be a pain. What is it? I used to teach uh, every now and then. I do like in-person 3D workshops. And one of the things I did was I taught people how to model a coffee cup. And it was always a pain wow. trying to teach them how to make the handle. <laughs> it took so long. Because like it's, it's a bunch of people who had never like used a software like Blender before. So they're all trying to figure it out. But yeah. when you t have a bunch of people try and model something that, you know... Something like it's that. It's hard at first. Yeah. It's impossible. It's like, ugh. It makes me sad. But it's all right. Especially the handles for anyone new. Yeah. Um. Oh gosh. Edit mode. No. Uh oh, I can't see my model. Um. Okay. Uh oh, we're already at six minutes and I don't even have the coffee pot finished. I haven't started my coffee pot. Are you, just, are you just working on a pistachio? Uh, no, I'm just working on the background. Oh, snap. Ooh, that worked really well. I am happy with that. Okay, so we got that. Like a dark black plastic. I'm gonna make this chrome. Hmm. Oh, somebody just joined? Or did I just hear things? I think so. I heard that too. I might just have to make a coffee pot without a handle because I still don't have a pistachio. <laughs> oh wait, I have an idea. Um, nope, never mind. That's a bad idea. I don't have time to do that. Ah, panic ensues. Um, where am I? No, I don't have any textures. What happened to them all? Oh no. Okay. Well, I guess we're going with my minimalist background again. That's so sad. Okay. I guess now I have time to do more uh, with the pistachio. I don't know what to do. It's 
still haven't made my pistachio. You you made your pistachio? No, not yet. Oh, not yet. Okay. Um, where's the displace modifier? There we go. Oh, not noise. We want clouds. Big clouds. Okay. And then. Okay, this is going to be a singular pistachio. And then let's do. I'm literally going to make them whole hands. Red, green, blue. bump and we'll just select a random file off my computer as the uh, as the texture because I don't have any textures um, let's see what might work okay. you know what we're gonna use this random picture because this random picture seems to work Although it is not appearing to do anything at all. What in the world? What's the time? Um, oh shoot, we have 25 seconds left. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> Rut row. Starts with the pistachio. Uh oh. I'm gonna have to slap uh, up this picture in my. No 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 no. Okay, well, I guess we are literally just doing a coffee pot with a singular pistachio for me, and time is up. Oh, okay. Everybody, render your coffee pot with a pistachio, and uh, we can all laugh at each other's abominations. I have to do my thingy again. I don't think me going for realism was the move in this uh, this round. Same. That was a Same. bad idea. Um, let's see here. Where's my render settings? 256, 256. I didn't do any composition at all either. Me neither. There's no composition in chaos. I, I barely even did lighting. I had an HDRI that I picked out early that I liked, but that's all. So I just kind of have a, like a pot. It's not even a coffee pot. Well, I guess it is a coffee pot, but it's not like a <laughs> notably a coffee pot. Would it be fun to? Is it okay if I just like add a denoise? Yeah, yeah, for sure. If you're just making like little tweaks to like render settings and stuff, that's all good. Okay. Coffee pot with a pistachio. Save as image. Okay, and we'll save this Blender file as well. Coffee pot with a pistachio. Sweet. All right. Um, do, do, do. We'll go ahead and start going along here. Uh, once I get my coffee pot with a pistachio scent. Oh, some people have some actually creative entries compared to mine. I literally make, I guess a, a few people made a coffee pot with a pistachio. Some yeah. people made a coffee pot. Oh! Yo, Opus Geo's is really cool. I like his. Alright, as he's coming, or sorry, go ahead, what? Uh, I'm off now. Oh, alright. Um, oh, he meant like, oh, <laughs> I was really confused what he meant by I'm off, but like he's actually off. Like, <laughs> I would have said goodbye, Tom, I'm sorry. 
Tom, come back. <laughs> I didn't realize that's what he meant. I thought he said he was like done. I meant he was done talking. Okay. Anyway, bye, Tom. Thanks for joining in for the stream. Um, all right, Blenderbach. So we're making a coffee pot. I mean, yeah, with a pistachio. Uh, what is it? We got Opus Geos. I really like his with the little googly eye on the pistachio. I don't know what's up with this little sad, sad pistachio down here, though. He looks so depressed. Oh, that's a coffee bean. I don't know. Um, let's keep going here. We got grant number two, how to make coffee with a little pistachio. Just going, bruh. I like the, I like the labels you put on it. <laughs> That's a really nice touch grant. Um, what else we got here? We got Vivs with a coffee. Oh, with the, that's creative. Um, the pistachios branding for their brand. It's a pistachios bag, but it says coffee pot on it. It's a good idea. Um, we got a coffee pot and a pistachio. Very nice. Very nice. We got the gravity boy with his coffee, pistachio coffee, I guess. Very, very nice. Um, we got boombox artifacts are heavy and chrome slowed down my computer, but here's the best I got. That looks pretty nice. It's a little overexposed, but at least you got the shell on the pistachio. I didn't have time to do that at all. Um, this Moisty Spook. It's kind of an uncomfortable name. Um, he be bad. Or I be really bad. Wait, I really be bad. Wow, I cannot read. Um, you got Skooma Boy with the coffee pot inside of the pistachio. I thought that one was pretty creative. I actually really like Skumas. Yeah, Skumas was really cool this time around. And it's like simple too, you know? Mm -hmm. We'll give it a thumbs up as well. Uh, we got <laughs> Tom again with the horsey holding a coffee pot with a pistachio on top of it. We got mine, which is a coffee pot with no handle. Where I went for realism but failed miserably. That's a big pistachio too. I wish pistachios were that big. Uh, we got David Chi. I like abstract stuff more, but when it comes to speed, this is what he came up with. Low poly, that's how it happens a lot. Um, Jules, I ran out of time. Didn't we all? I like that you can see the reflection of the light from the HDRI, though. It's kind of cool. Uh, Gabe with... Oh, Gabe, yours is actually pretty cool, Gabe. <laughs> my, my coffee pot's just like this pistachios. <laughs> I like that he's just like, it's, it's holding it. It's like, it's mine. <laughs> that's kind of cute. Uh, 16 by 9. Again, another coffee pot with a pistachio like I did. Um, Pippi, a coffee pot with a pistachio on top. Skylifter, <laughs> a coffee pot with a pistachio in it, but then yeah, sharpened to the maximum crashed, setting. So had like four minutes to do everything. <laughs> Wait, it did? Yeah. Oh no. That's unfortunate. Um, but I like your image plane pistachio. It's a good solution. Crystal Keeper, my pistachio looks like a hot dog. Uh, Roan47 with a giant kettle with just a ton of pistachios is that what those are it looks like it jordan completely forgot the pistachio um what is it jacob's wang has <laughs> oh my gosh that is a huge pistachio grant number four can't render cycles right now but should be transparent Gotcha. I'll take your word for it. We can use our imaginations. Um, oh, Zohabe just came in. We got Zohabe's. I was what in <laughs> rendering mine. <laughs> I'm very confused as to what's going on in this. Is it's that like a... It's lifting off the coffee cup. Okay. Okay. I see that. I see that. That pistachio is very stretchy. <laughs> and I have a... <laughs> I have to know why is the coffee chrome or long just long <laughs> that's a work of art Zohabe a work of art as usual so dang I should have used the Utah teapot yeah what up why didn't anybody use the Utah teapot come on now <laughs> all right I think past this one we're gonna do one more of these and then uh, I think we're going to call it quits for the night because I do have stuff that i got to do later tonight. I've got a friend's birthday party I've got to go to, which should be exciting. So um, we'll let a uh... – oh, see you, Jordan. Thanks for tuning into the stream. Uh, while we're here and while we have one last stream or one last 
subject left to go. Chat, do you want to give us another uh, another random seed here? Last time it was Worldwide Scooby-Doo. What can you guys come up with? I'm curious. Or if anybody in voice chat wants to has any good ideas too. I'd love to hear those. We need a random seed. Burger Dog from Ooh. Burger Burger Dog Seed. Let's see. We got a few more coming in. I might as well throw chat over here so we can see it. Burger McDonald's, anything horsey. <laughs> I kind of like. I, 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 Wait, can you make the generator just generate an adjective and then we'll proceed with the noun? Oh, so you know what? Uh, I can't do that, but what I can do. We can just try and generate one until we get coronavirus. Oh God, wrong spaghetti. Um, wrong spaghetti is an OG one. We can keep generating whatever. one until we get one with horsey. Or what about we just generate one that we uh we generate them, but we replace whatever noun we get with horsey. Wait, I'm confused. Oh, oh, okay. You, you just generate it and then you use horsey instead of whatever it gives us. That's a good idea. Um, oh, some I just realized. Oh no. Like, uh, let's hang on. Save as. Ah, stop. There we go. Um, <laughs> Viv just pointed out my green screen went away because I changed my interface. Okay, so yeah, let's just do. Um, we'll use a we'll use a new a new seed. We're just gonna type in a bunch of these. Burger, zombie, wrong spaghetti. Spaghetti, got okay. Spaghetti misspelled. Coronavirus horsey all right that's our seed we'll save that as our seed and we're just going to replace every single noun we see in these we aren't going to be able to get one with just an adjective and a noun odds are but we can see if we can find one actually you know what <laughs> okay the subject this just generated is pretty good it's andrew price licking a smartphone <laughs> 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 okay, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of really like that one. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Okay, uh, Grant number two. Do you know who Andrew Price is? I have to look him up. But yeah, okay, I've okay. From yeah, he's he's Blender Guru. He's kind of like the, a big celebrity. So here's here's the ordeal. Okay, since we got one with Andrew Price, and Andrew Price is our Lord and Savior of Donuts, right? We're going to make Andrew Price looking a smartphone, but then after it's done, we either have to, we all, all of us, including myself, have to tweet him with our beautiful pictures of him licking a smartphone. Nice. I'll do it yeah. too. We'll all do it, all right? Or if you don't have Twitter, you can send it to him on Instagram or something. But that's, that's the goal. The goal is to get his attention by sending him pictures of himself <laughs> licking a smartphone. Are we adding him? Or are we... Uh, okay, okay. Because, yeah, I want, him. because I want this one to be good. We're gonna go 15 minutes. All right, mm -hmm. we got we got to make these good. All right, so we're gonna have 15 minutes to do this one. Andrew Price yeah. licking a smartphone. Digital tongue to his face. Yeah, honestly, you know what is that? Uh, he's gonna be at the America or U.S. Blender Conference this year, so uh, oh. I might as well. I might just print off all of them and just hand them to him in like a, a document. Just here's here's a here's a booklet of you licking a smartphone modeled by like. Okay, by the way, if you're watching this, if you're watching this right now and you're just ambulantly watching, please model this one with us and please send it in Discord chat. We have to see these beautiful results. Andrew Price licking a smartphone, all right? All right, this is going to be the last one for the night. Let's finish it off strong and move into the future. All right, you guys ready to go with Andrew Price and his smartphone? Okay, let's go ahead and get started here. All right. Let me get a drink of water. All right. I'm going to take, actually, before we start here, I'm going to take a screenshot of the prompt. That way I can uh, give him some context. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. Okay, and we'll save this desktop. Okay. Did All you right. start the timer? No, I haven't started the timer yet. Sorry. All right, timer is gonna start in three, two, one, start. Okay, we'll start by deleting the default cube and adding it back in immediately. That's, That's exactly what I did. 
Oh gosh, what does Andrew Price's hair look like? Um, he's kind of got like a bowl haircut, doesn't he? Look. Because it reminds me of the time where we all made um, thick Elon Musk. And oh, we did at Elon oh, yeah. Musk. Yeah, that was a pretty good one. Although I'm saying we had like zero chance of getting response with Elon. With this one, we definitely have a chance because I've you know I've, yeah. I I know I don't know Andrew, but we know each other and we know we exist. So. Has my hair too. <laughs> oh my god, it's gonna look like a Minecraft character when I'm done with this. <laughs> I'm kind of like imagining the mouth shape, and I'm like struggling to do so. Wait, are you not using an image? Me? I'm. I'm just going like off what I remember of him. Fully digital Andrew. <laughs> um, I'm gonna put a donut on the phone's screen. Oh, there you go, that's a good idea. <laughs> Wait, what does a donut have to do with it? Um, so Andrew Price has this tutorial and it's kind of like famous in the Blender yeah. community where he guides beginners through making a donut. So, oh, I was yeah. gonna put like a blender logo on the phone or something. Ah, I have to look at myself like, hang on, I gotta, you're gonna see me make a face on stream really quick here because I need to see my face because I need to know what expression this is. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking at myself in the, the thing. Uh, hmm, okay. Gosh, this is gonna be so bad. It's already so bad. Ah, Jack, would you do drop? <laughs> would you drop? Would you drop? Got some rage after losing in Tarkov. I, I maybe. <laughs> Naming my file Andrew Licking. Gosh, I don't. Okay, you know I have to pull up a reference image of Andrew. Well, I'm not alone. Okay. Um, can I just like? He's got a weird head shape. Why is this dude Same got such grand. <laughs> This dude's got such high cheekbones. He's a very cheeky boy. What a Chad. What, what a Chad. <laughs> oh no, I just oh oof. That just completely destroyed his mouth shape. Alright, whatever. We'll deal with it. I'm kind of regretting saying that I'd tweet this at him as well, because this is going to be an abomination. <laughs> like, at least you could recognize Elon Musk in mine. This one? Nah, no, not at all. Wait, Grant, are you watching the stream chat? It's watching the stream chat. Oh, gosh. 
<laughs> I just see big pictures of Andrew Price. Um, okay. Like the reference I found. Start off with a skin color. Material preview. If I give him some teeth, it'll look more normal. <laughs> oh, oh. It'll either look better or worse. It'll look better. 100%. I think that looks a little bit better. Not a lot, but like a little bit. Time. Oh, we only got eight minutes left. Oh, gosh. I don't know how I uh, plan that on drawing this now. I think it's going to extend more like a straw than anything. Wait, <laughs> what's going to extend like a straw? His mouth. <laughs> 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 Gosh, I'm getting rid of this hair. I don't like this hair at all. How am I gonna do hair? Ah! Yeah, I, I'm actually kind of hoping that, uh, was it, Vivian's still participating in this right now? Because she might be able to actually draw a decent Andrew Price in this, this short period of time. Yeah, hers will probably look the most like Andrew Price. What is this, a GameCube logo? Almost GameCube. What is his hair? Like, almost black, but not quite. Like a very dark brown. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think we're on next stream. I think we should all have to make you. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. That sounds dangerous. Uh, we should get we... him to participate in one of the challenges. Andrew? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that would be fun. That would be fun. I actually have been talking to a few other um, Imagine if blender Andrew's people. That can be his revenge. He gets to make you. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I don't like the sound of that. Wait, who is. Oh, there we go. I feel like the hair was a big part of why mine didn't look right. Oh, that is not a good face color. We got five minutes left. I love it when I miss and I hit the outline instead and it just ruins everything. Oh yeah, that's always the, enjoyable. Uh, tool. All right, um... All right, um, let's 
see here, solidify. Oh, I wonder if how bald face their enterprise actually looks good. Wait, what? Look in stream chat. Oh, oh God. <laughs> I think they used face builder or something. That might make sense. That's horrifying. Wait, what? <laughs> okay. Uh, we got three minutes and 52 seconds left. Saturation. All right. Whew. Oh, here we'll make him licking a picture of himself. <laughs> Down the lines. <laughs> oh, there's a horrifying picture. Um, <laughs> should we make him lick a picture of me? <laughs> just kidding. No. <laughs> oh no, it's just his mouth. Ah, I don't feel like remapping it. That's horrifying. Okay. <laughs> Like uh, maybe mine dislocated some fingers. Oh no, I made him shirtless. Ah! <laughs> oh god. <okay. laughs> I thought I had plenty of time to do compositing, and it took three minutes to render. Wait, Grant, uh, give him uh, some muscles. Got a minute left, or a minute and thirty seconds. Oh man, 44 seconds left. Oh god. seconds eight seven six five four three two one time nice. oh andrew price licking a smartphone all right hang on i want to add extremely cursed i want to add some depth of field to this really quick so i'm going to take that liberty but other than that we're calling this quits oh gosh okay um camera Depth of field. 
focus on the empty. This is atrocious. I'm so sad. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and hit the render button here. Um. No, oh, oh, I forgot to. Okay, hang on. Do 256 samples and performance. 256 by 256. That should really be by default, but I, it is not for some reason. Oh, did, I didn't turn on denoising. Uh, I, I see all your guys' creations coming in, and they're pretty abominable. I want to let you all know that. <laughs> you know, I feel like Andrew's going to be so confused, because what is it? What time is it in Australia right now? Australia? What? What, uh, what, what time Australia? is it in Australia? No, no, somebody used Keen Tools. Currently 11.48 a.m., so we're just gonna like for his lunch. We're just gonna send this guy a bunch of pictures of himself licking his smartphone. Anyone who isn't on Twitter or <laughs> anything where they can post, you have to make an account. Yeah. Just to just to send this to price. <laughs> He's gonna be so confused. <laughs> like okay let's be real oh. if you were in andrew price's shoes right now if you're just like an average joe going about your daily business down in the southern hemisphere of earth and all of a sudden you're just flooded with pictures of you licking your own smartphone <laughs> what do you do <laughs> what well, what do you do you don't know if it's your own smartphone because it was just looking a smartphone oh that's true that's true that's true big thing <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, we should have made it so everyone was only allowed to use such Polygon. Oh, we should have. <laughs> this this live stream was sponsored by Polygon.com. <laughs> oh man. All right. Let's hear. Your, let's go through these final. Oh my god. I accidentally clicked on one and it's all like It's horrible. <laughs> Okay, okay. Uh, by the way, if you guys tweet it, if you haven't already tweeted it, tag me in it as well. I'd love to see what you guys... I, I just want to see you guys do it. Um, my Twitter is at Remy underscore creative, and my Instagram is at Remy underscore, underscore creative. So tag me. I want to see what these... I want to see his reactions. Please. Oh my god, boombox. That's horrifying. <laughs> it looks like... Oh... <laughs> okay, wait, wait. If you guys aren't looking at the live stream right now, look at the live stream. You wake up in the morning and you see this staring at you. What do you do? <laughs> Imagine just joining in on the live stream on that. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, um, okay. So here we got our our reference images from Isaac, and then we got a, a awareness content increased. Um, okay, so Gabe's progress. Okay, so we start off with a bald eagle with a piece of art, and it's just horrifying. Oh, you know what? I bet he just projection mapped the uh, Andrew Price's face onto a human bust. Great. That might oh, be yeah. what it is. Thank you. Um, okay. So we got Boombox with just an eyeball. I'm sure more come more to come. <laughs> the power of the donut compels you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Andrew. <laughs> this speaks for all of us. Um, who's this? The Gravity Boys apology speaks for all of us. Sorry, Andrew. Um, curse level's extreme. Sky, no. Why'd you have to animate it, man? Man, why'd you have to animate it, man? Okay. Uh, Jeremiah Parker, yes, post for me. I don't have any social media. Okay, I'll see if I can post yours for you or if somebody else can. That's just a, kind of uncomfortable. It looks like a pink, like, ugh. Bubble gum. Yeah, it does look like a yeah, giant lump of gum. Uh, Boombox, I really hate this. Don't worry, we all do. <laughs> Um, <laughs> David G. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Oh boy! And then we got okay. This is the one I clicked on and it cracked me up. Is uh, is Jacobs? Uh, it's. 
I hope we have bleach here, because I'm going to need to chug a gallon of it after this live stream. Okay, um, it more <laughs> moisty spook again, with, uh, I have some October material here. That's, yep, that's, that's beautiful. Um, grant number four with a donut licking Andrew Price. Very nice. Um, Jules with another Andrew Price licking a phone. Very nice, very nice. Um, uh, boombox. This is better, right? Yeah, that looks, I don't, actually, I don't know how that's any different from what you had before. Oh, longer tongue. Very nice. Yeah, you can see more of the face. Um, oh, Viv did one. Very nice. Oh, you had a donut ring. Very nice. That's a work of art. I like that you put the Blender Guru logo on his shirt, too. Um, Opus Geo actually did hair, and it's a donut phone. Very nice. Very nice. Grant number two. Got the polygon in there. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I w okay, so I, Grant, when you first sent yours, I looked at it and I was like, okay, he's looking at his phone, and I kind of just scrolled past it. Now I'm realizing just how long his tongue is. <laughs> yeah, he's got like a frog there. It's like it's like it's like moist, like it's, it's leaving streaks on the phone. That's horrifying. Also, his shirt doesn't say polygon. Yeah, I, I well, you got the logo, but it's all right. All right, um, we got old, very old picture of Andrew Price. I has a smartphone, my favorite. And we got mine, which is shirtless Andrew Price licking a smartphone. Um, Zohabe. Oh, wait. <laughs> okay, hang on. We got two Andrew Prices, and one of their tongues is penetrating through the phone <laughs> to lick the other Andrew Price. I don't, I'm not okay with this. <laughs> I'm gonna need to go to therapy. Wait, wait. <laughs> I tweeted it at him uh, and tagged you in it. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, yeah. what is it we got? Okay, we got a donut there. <laughs> looking at Polygon phone. Okay, that one's a little bit more dark. <laughs> we got Randrake looking the phone. Nice. Skooma. Mine's amazing, I think. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, Scuba, that's awesome! Oh my god! It's the spring. That's, yeah, the goofy spring one. That's perfect! That's perfect! I really like that one, yeah. The expression is perfect too, like on <laughs> Spring's face, the shock. <laughs> Scuba, <laughs> high five for that one. You you deserve that. You deserve a virtual high five. Um, Gabe, with the donut on the phone and just an image playing with Andrew Price in a tongue. Very nice, very nice. Uh, Boombox, come back with the creepy face. Uh, oh, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, I, you're, now you're pinning it on me. You're at Remy Creative made me do it. Oh, God. Oh, we got Pippi. Very nice, very nice. Uh, <laughs> Lee Fozzy. Beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Can someone tweet mine for me? Okay. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do my tweet at Andrew Price. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Wait, I don't even know what to say. His hey, last tweet was seven minutes ago. <laughs> Andrew. Yeah. S sorry about the atrocities <laughs> you're you're about to witness. Your name <laughs> came came up in. Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> All right, uh, we'll attach mine, and we'll also attach the chaos modeling prompt. Um, okay, so who's Holy didn't, who needs one for, uh, to send? I think Viv said she needs somebody to tweet hers, so I'll download hers and tweet hers. Wait, I really like box. your loop poly one. Thank you, I put so much effort into it. A whole 15 <laughs> minutes worth of effort. Um, where's Viv's? Oh, there it is, okay. Save image, downloads. Oh. Downloads. Where'd it go? It was... Wait, uh, that's Vivian's? Yeah, the drawing oh. one. Oh, that's amazing, yeah. It is very nice, I agree. Um, but apparently it didn't save, so we're going to have to open it in Chrome and save it. 
Oh, there we go. Now it's saved. All right. So we'll throw that one in there. Oh, wait. Where'd, where'd my Chrome window go? Oh, I'm stupid. Okay. Did it save my tweet? Ah, oh, no. Hey, <laughs> there's Gabe's. <laughs> okay. Um, we'll try this again. At Andrew Price. <laughs> I should just say, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's all my fault. <laughs> okay. Yeah, don't explain it right away. <laughs> okay, we'll attach Vivian's. We'll throw mine in there. Um, who else needs one? We'll check Discord again. Oh, wait. I don't need that. Stop. Go away. Okay. Um, who else said they need one? Uh, Boombox needs his tweeted. Boombox? Okay. Uh, can I just tweet the creepy one? Did he have a final one? Uh, think... yeah, he had a final one. <laughs> Where is it? Boombox. Oh, there it is. Okay, we'll we'll say we'll put them both in it. We gotta put both of them in there because the the one that looks like yeah. he's wearing a hockey mask is way way creepier. <laughs> and that's our objective here is to be as creepy as possible. Okay. Um, where's hockey mask? There it is. <laughs> oh goodness. Poor Andrew. <laughs> He's probably like, what is happening? He's probably like got like a really important like work deadline coming up for Polygon, and we're just over here sending him pictures. I think he's active on Twitter. Uh... I'm sorry, it's all my fault. I gotta say something that I'm sorry. It's all my fault. There's gotta be there's gotta be something else other than that I can say that would incite a reaction. Um, no, no comments allowed. <laughs> uh, it's all my fault. And the how many people did we have? Like thirty other people <laughs> modeling with me. I have amassed an no, army. I don't know. <laughs> A cow army. All right, we'll just leave it at. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's all my fault. <laughs> Here we go. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> oh, these works of art. These works of absolute art. A gift for Andrew Price. <laughs> oh boy. All right. <laughs> Poor Andrew. Poor, poor Andrew. I'm sorry, Andrew. If you're, like, in any way, shape, or form watching this right now, I'm so sorry. But I'm not sorry at all at the same time. <laughs> all right. Well, with that, ladies and jellyfish, I think we're going to call the stream quits. I had a fun time creating these atrocities. Hopefully you did as well. And uh, hopefully Andrew gets back to some of us about our, our horrifying creations that we made of him. <laughs> Because if he doesn't, I'm going to be very upset. And if he, you know what, if he doesn't get back to us, I'll make sure that, uh, I'll make sure that he sees all of them and I get some sort of reaction from him at the Blender Conference in, uh, LA this year. So, uh, yeah, let's do it. Thank you all for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you everybody in voice chat right now for joining me. You guys made it a lot more fun than it would have been doing it alone. Uh, and hopefully, we'll be able to do something like this again soon. So, see you all later. And uh, let me find OBS so I can stop the stream. All right. Hasta luego. Bye. Bye. <laughs>